I'm worth like $2 million. <laughs> To another amazing vlog a new day a new hairstyle it is wednesday it's wednesday i have to ah! i have to say that um because i feel like when i don't like when i'm editing it just i'll be like what the hell was i doing when hair's different again took the braid wig off she's gone say la vie bye bye um so today we gotta go to target again i need to go eat what else what else what else what else i have an audition that i shot that i need to edit and send off don't mind that back there my upholstery this car is this is my baby so he he might be a little rough but this is my baby anyway um so we are going to i don't forgot what i was saying we got some shit we gonna do I'm gonna try not to make this vlog boring because I feel like I feel like the last couple of ones though have been really good. Um, I just don't want to car talk and vent and go to store y'all to heck. You know what I'm saying? I still want it to be fun. So yeah, that's what we're doing today. Um, I would love to exercise, but uh, I need to start. I've been running again, and I need to run at some point today. So yeah, and y'all, remember how I was talking about my eyebrows in the last vlog? I am in love. I don't know who needs to hear this, and this is hair product all over my head. I don't know who needs to hear this, but bleach your eyebrows. Let your eyebrows grow out like caterpillars, because I have thick caterpillar eyebrows. I get it from my beautiful father. What is this? I need to go get my car detail. Grow out your eyebrows. Let somebody professionally shape them for your face bleach them bleach them white let them start to grow out and then fill them in with a light brown pencil eat eat like ugh. so anyway that's what we're doing today i don't really have any other plans i'm trying to increaseify and y'all gonna learn on this channel i make up words even though i'm the grammar queen aka miss english major aka has won writing competitions bitch I make up words. I'm a wordsmith. And the word of today is increaseify. It's a combination of intensify and increase. So if I say increaseify, that means shit just got real. So you. Yeah. Let's start this day. I'm going to try to make it fun. See y'all in a bit. Okay, so it's Saturday, but let's get into it. First of all, my eyes are red. I barely slept last night. For good reason but i just had to host a live and they're on new york time and i'm not on new york time which and i'm in the bathroom doing my hair i'm like i'm gonna go eat and like take my time before the show girl something in my spirit nudges me and is like girl you about to you gonna miss your live i look i'm like oh my god they're an hour ahead so i literally have five minutes to but i have mascara on one eye my eyes are red I just have so anyway come on i have to host another live in 40 minutes but i need to quickly make breakfast finish my makeup because what one eye just looks bald i was on the live and i'm like why do i look like that my eyes bald so anyway i'm gonna bring y'all with me we're gonna have breakfast and um i was so anxious because i'm just like please don't let them be able to tell that i have a bald eyelash but i thank god i prepared the night before as you should when you host a live but it's just like i literally was not ready i was not ready i was not ready i was not ready but that's okay because now we're gonna get ready we're gonna go have breakfast i'm sleepy we're gonna go have breakfast after i finish this for the day i think i only have like I got something else I'm supposed to do today, child. I don't forgot what it was. It's on my calendar, though. I don't know. But I'm going to be real with y'all. I'm going to take it real easy. I'm going to be taking it really easy today. Um, Because I am kind of sleepy. I ain't going to lie. I put my hair in this little cute... I try. Oh! Should look at this shit. I tried to put it in this cute little pineapple, but it didn't really... 
do what I wanted it to do, but that's okay. But yeah, we're gonna go eat in a second. And then, um, I don't know what else we're doing today. Honestly, I might just go back to sleep. I'm tired. But I'm very thankful and very happy and very blessed, favorite, fortunate, all that. I hope that everything is going well with y'all. I'm acting like we're on a FaceTime call. I'm mad because, yeah, it's just, whoo, I am, I am so blessed because literally I was like, like, you know how you know something was just like, I, I envisioned a whole scenario where the executive producer of the TV show that I was hosting a live for was panicking trying to call me and I'm like why am I feeling like this like why am I feeling her emotions like hold up I was just like why am I feeling this right now like what what is going on and so girl I'm so happy I went and looked because I would have missed it now I have another one to host literally in like 30 minutes so I need to go make food because I, I was hangry I was hangry the whole time and the whole time I was on there with them I was just like I just want to eat like I was flowing I don't know if they could tell but the voice was raspy I am parched so let's go eat I'm gonna shut up now Tuesday, it's super early in the morning. I was supposed to post this vlog yesterday, but I didn't. I went to a dance class last night and it was super fun. Um, and I'm having breakfast right now. I have an audition. I have two auditions, one of which I didn't even know existed. I just found out about it. Thank God. I'm about to shoot that one as soon as I finish eating. And then I'm going to study for the other one to shoot later. I got invited to do a YouTube video tonight, so I don't know if I'm going to do it or not. And I technically still have to upload this one and I have to cook dinner and record it because one of the things that I'm using to cook dinner is a collab. But look at my nails. They're so freaking cute. And one of the diamonds came off. I just got them done yesterday. One of the diamonds came off of this one. So I'm going to have to fix that at some point. But they're cute. I love them so much. Let me show you. They are literally so freaking pretty i cannot and literally i came up with this design in my mind i know i wanted dark blue and i wanted some sort of gold like i wanted like gold like fireworks designs but then i went online and tried to look that up and then i saw this design and i was like this is so much better but yes girl these nails eat slay hey y'all so we are i just left okay a couple of things happened so i did my audition <clears throat> and then we went um, I turned the audition in and then I went with Keon who's my friend and a photographer you can follow him here um, he does a lot of my like he's done some of my video shoots um, my pictures that y'all see on Instagram but anyway we did some pictures that he had for a concept in at the park and then after that I had to go run to my PO box to pick up some shit and then I got my nails done yesterday, which I think I showed y'all. But two, I woke up and two of my stones fell off. So I went there and they literally redid it. And like, it was quick, but they were about to close. So anyway, I was in the mood to like, I'm in the mood. It's very specific to go see like a good 60s or 70s B horror movie. I'm talking about like, and I think these movies might actually be older. I'm talking about The Blob invasion of the body snatchers so i found a theater and i want the theater that i go to i either want it to be like a drive-in or outdoor or a rooftop theater but i want it to feel like a little grimy a little you know i don't feel like doing the bougie movie theater or the amc or the regal like i'm not in the mood for that so i found a place that does that like literally every but it's every sunday they do horror movies at like old horror movies at 10 p.m i will be doing that this week but today unfortunately there's nothing going on and all the movies that are at the regular theater suck and i don't want to go to the regular theater by myself so i just hit up my friends to see what they're doing because i'm like maybe we can do this together maybe we can do this at home but as of now i'm just gonna go home and like make popcorn and snacks and then cook dinner while dinner's cooking i'll watch you know i'll watch the first movie and then maybe do intermission maybe just make it like a thing like i feel like and this is a message <clears throat> 
if you want something, an experience, a person, a certain amount of money, whatever, but it's not yet available in your reality, sometimes it means that you might need to be still. But I feel like, and I, I feel like sometimes it means that you need to create it. So I was like, instead of me waiting around and like, oh, I'll just wait till Sunday and not do this thing that I really want to do. Like, I really want this. Like, this is what I want to do today. I'm going to go fucking create it myself. So that's what I'm going to do. And it sound, to me, it feels a little sad because I'm like, I want to do exactly what I want to do. But it's all good. So we're heading to Whole Foods and I'm going to take y'all in with me. I did grocery shopping the other day, but we're going to get some little yummy treats and see if we can make ourselves some movie theater snacks. And then I need to pick what movies I'm going to watch. I'm also going to, after I watch my movies, I have to study for an audition that I'm going to shoot tomorrow. So this is going to be a really fun night. So let's get into it. And I'm super hungry. So let's get to Whole Foods. I know it was kind of like weird today's wednesday i was supposed to have this up on monday but that's okay um i've been very 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 busy i'm mad because i broke another gym oh my nail which means i gotta go back to the nail salon today but anyway starting a new vlog today it's wednesday we're two days behind i have a bunch of stuff to catch up on but real quick the title of this video is i'm rich and the reason why i say that is because at this point i'm literally worth like 300 million dollars I'm worth like $2 million. I think that sometimes we get caught up. I think that sometimes we get caught up in material wealth, which is beautiful and very important. I think it's great to be able to enjoy material things, the luxuries of life. I know I enjoy them. You know what I'm saying? I'm never going to say that I don't enjoy that. But I'm rich for the simple fact of everything in my life that I'm blessed with, the little things in life that you are blessed with, the ability that you can go outside, that you can pick up a phone, that you have a friend that you can call, that you have family. Those little tiny things in life make you so, so rich and so abundant. And I really wanted that to be like a bigger part of this vlog, but y'all, I got so busy. But if you're ever in a position where you feel like you're lacking physical, financial, you know, abundance, think about all the ways in which you are rich. Think about all the things in your life that if you didn't have right now, how much harder everything would be. Little things. The fact that, you know, you have a place to sleep that you can eat. Um, but I'm talking about even smaller than that. The fact that, you know, you walk in grass and it's soft. Sometimes it's not soft. Or the fact that you go outside and you can breathe. The fact that, you know, all of these little things that you complain about, that you have the ability to even do them, is... It makes you so rich and I think that in general I think there needs to be a greater movement towards us being more appreciative of the basic things you know just to start and be more grateful and moving through a gratitude space um, because I know that's helped me significantly just realizing like all the ways in which I am rich which I am grateful which I'm abundant like I have days where I'm like this isn't going right that isn't going right but it's like I'm rich because I have this and this and this and it's like once you start moving into that space you start noticing that the material things catch up you start getting more money you start getting gifts abundance opportunities jobs but you have to be on the same wavelength as the frequency of abundance and gratitude so I hope that's helpful for you guys this was a really interesting vlog I have so much work to do I love y'all and I'll see y'all in the next one see y'all later